Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to talk about uh, VBA automation, how to send the data to a PDF file. Excel VBA can not only transfer data between software in Office Suite, but also other software like uh, web browser, Adobe Acrobat, and uh, AutoCAD by using automation. The methods are similar. You only need to know the object you need it and the syntax of using them. You can find those reference documentation easily on the internet. But to achieve this function, there are something you need to be aware. First, you need a Adobe Acrobat Pro to be installed on your computer. If you only have Adobe Reader installed on your computer, this method will not work. Second, it only works on form field. But uh, you can add or edit a form field easily in Acrobat, so it will not be a too much a problem. Third, if uh, it's an encrypted uh, PDF file, you have to unlock it first. There are lots of websites online can unlock a PDF file. Okay, uh, with all being said, let's see an example. Here is a template I made. So I can send the data to any PDF file that support this method by only changing some of the setting in the Excel. We see here we have a standard B2B trading form. So we need to fill in this form, include some basic uh, information like name and account number. For example, we have a client personal data already in Excel. We need to send those data to the B2B PDF file and save to the folder we wanted. Let's see how it works. Okay, we have generate a PDF file and uh, we see all the data are already be sent in. Now let's see the code. It seems a lot of line of code, but the first five lines are just to create the object required by the Adobe Acrobat. The last couple lines of code are just to exit the Acrobat application and release the object we created for the job. So in this case, we only use two methods here. Method get field to write the PDF and the method save to save the file. And uh, of course, we could do much more than just read or write a PDF file. Here is a link of document of how to program Acrobat in VB environment. And uh, here is a link of Acrobat uh, API reference. Since I only spent a couple of hours to read those documentation, so this video is just gonna scratch the surface of this topic. Okay, now the only thing left here is to find the name of the text field or the checkbox field in the PDF file. It is quite easy. Just open the PDF file and use the shortcut Control Shift and Seven. Then all the field name will be there and uh, you can double click on any of them to edit it or you can create a text field or a checkbox field if you want so even if you have a pdf file created by some image you can manually create your own text field first and then batch process the multiple pdf file okay that's concluded this video I hope you find it useful. Thanks for watching and uh, I will see you soon.